Libra, what is up and what is good with y'all? Welcome and welcome back to my channel, guys. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. So, I was just pre-shuffling your cards. And this is going to be the singles read for November 2022. And this came out. It says, Abundance, Financial Blessings, Healthy Money Perspective, Financial Independence. Okay, so that's coming in for you, or it's already here. I do feel like there's an increase in your finances, okay? Um, so I do see some money coming towards you, or this may be money that is owed to you, okay? And then you have pregnancy. It says, Getting Pregnant, Building a Family, Giving Birth to Something. Okay, so you may be pregnant or building a family with your person. And if you're single, which this is for you guys, the singles read, I do feel like you're giving birth to something. And it could be this financial blessing, okay, or this um, abundance that's coming in for you, okay. I do see you having a more healthy relationship to money, a more healthy perspective to money. And at the bottom of the deck, you are happy about this. It says happiness. Finding happiness happy ending feeling blessed and grateful so you're feeling very blessed and very grateful right now okay i feel like there's a happy ending for you and i do feel like you're finding happiness okay within yourself or you may have coupled up with someone it says new cycle new beginnings it says the end of a cycle making a fresh new start so i feel like the cycle has closed out um you know, with just a lot of people, places, and things that were no longer serving your highest good. And I do see new beginnings coming in for you. I'm seeing a fresh new start here. So, yeah. Alright. So, what else do you have for the singles? Spirit. What is the current energy right now for Libra? Singles. What is the current energy? Yeah. It says work. Focus on work, working hard, and long hours. So you're really focused on your work, okay? There may be a love interest at work, somebody who has their eye on you at work, or you're just really, really in love with what you do for work. Okay. Hmm. Let me clarify this card. What happened in the past? Give me the past energy. What happened in the past with the singles? Libra singles. What happened in the past? Two cards wanted to fall out. What happened in the past? Hmm. There we go. I feel like someone in the past was stringing you along. Okay, it says being strung along, giving false hope, selfish intentions. Okay, I do feel like this person is a love bomber. It says emotionally manipulation, casting over ladies' man. Okay, wants your attention. So I feel like this past person did want a lot of your attention, but they were stringing you along. Okay, and then it says plastic. Surface level relationship. It says fake love messages. It says not a real love connection. So this relationship went plastic. Okay, and now this person, this past person is wanting to reconcile with you. They want to work things out. This unfinished business they feel... They are returning to you, okay? But you have some other stuff going on in your life, and you're not focused on this past person. Let's see. What's the current energy for Libra? What's the current energy for Libra singles? What's the current energy surrounding Libra singles right now? What's the current energy for this past person? What is the current energy? How do you feel about this past person? How do you feel about this past person for Libra? How does Libra feel about this past person? Okay, so it says children. Children involved, using child as a pawn, stand for the kids. So you see this person coming back in towards you. They may have done this already. Using the children that you have with them as a pawn. There may be children involved or they were just staying for the kids. Okay, there's, there's children here. Alright, but I feel like you're punishing your ex. It says revenge body, looking your best, focusing on yourself. So yeah, you're more focused on yourself. You're not focused on this person. You're focused on work here. Okay, give me some energy for the new love interest. Give me some more energies for a new love interest for Libra singles. New love interest for Libra singles, if there is one. 
it says engagement, commitment promises, it says making it official, there is marriage in your future when it comes to this new person, okay, I do see a commitment like a, a engagement ring, okay, Hmm. Some of you may be all up in your head about this, maybe overthinking, okay? But I feel like this new person thinks about you a lot if you have met them. If if you have not met them yet, this is what's going to come in for you, okay? Give me some more. Yeah. Yeah, you're leaving this cycle permanently closed with this past person. You're saying goodbye to the old. Okay, you're not giving them any more chances. No matter if they reconcile with you or try to use these kids as a pawn to stay with you, it's over and it's done. Okay, period. Period, boo. Period, ew. Okay, period. Yeah, and I feel like you separated yourself from this person. It says separation, withdrawal, disconnect, test of love. Yeah, this relationship got weak because this person, this past person was a player. They weren't... um you know, being uh, faithful, they were very non-committal, playing the field, they were refusing to commit to you, okay? And so you're like, fuck that, that cycle's permanently closed, I'm done. New love energy? Hmm. So with this past person's energy still showing up, this person refuses to change... But you're both standing your ground. You make you have your backs turned to each other, okay? But with this new person, I do see um, protection here. It says, it says, don't want to hurt you. Protecting connection, protective over you. This new person is very protective over you. If you hear the dog barking, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, I feel like this person had a shift in their perspective here. Okay, there was a lot of love lessons that you've learned, and I do feel like you're raising your vibration. Okay. <laughs> hmm. So I feel like this past person who you cut out of your life is going to try to call you. But I feel like you are in separation and you cut ties with them. Okay. I do feel like you and this new person have feelings for each other. So you're not. You're not engaging in that. You're not interested. Because it says phone call, wanting to talk, and then it says cut out. Cutting ties and separation, leaving before it gets worse, cutting your losses. So, you're like, no, get away from me. What part don't you understand? I'm with somebody new or there's a new love interest around me right now. And I'm interested in them. I'm focusing on myself. Focusing on my work. I'm not interested in the past. What part don't you understand? And this is not my energy coming in, you guys. This is yours. For someone out there. Like, you're non-committal. You're, you're playing the field. You're, you're never choosing me. Like, no. I'm not dealing with it. I'm not wasting my time with you no more. Poof, be gone, goodbye. Period. Ugh. Like, I don't know where this energy is coming from. But Libra, I'm telling you right now, it's coming from you. Okay, it's coming from you. Okay, current energy with the new love interest. Ten of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. This person wants everything with you. They want long term. They want a long term committed relationship with you. They want to uh, They want to have kids with you or combine families with you. Um, they see you as their end all be all. Okay, with the Ten of Pentacles. Alright. Hmm. This person is a workaholic or this is you. Alright, tell me some more. Uh, give me some more energy for the new love interest. Spirit for Libra, November 2022. Give me some energy for the new love interest. Alright. Yeah, Ten of Cups. See? Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups. You got I'm sorry about that. That was my son. So yeah, this person wants marriage with you. I do see in the future they're going to have marriage on the brain here. Uh, Pisces energy with the Ten of Cups. Alright. Yeah, they want they want a happily ever after with you. They want a long term relationship, marriage, stability, security. Okay, they want to have children with you. Yeah, they see you as their end all be all. I feel like this person is putting all their eggs into one basket when it comes to you. Can you give me some more messages for the new love interest that's coming in for Libra if it's if this person is not here already? Can I get some more energies for the new love interest for Libra? Three of Cups. You're going to be so happy about this. 
there's going to be a lot in your life that you are celebrating or you're going to be celebrating. I do see this is what is on this person's mind. But right now they just want it a little, you know, casual. I feel like they do, um, they fantasize about the future with you. Like way ahead of time. Yeah, this person wants to give you flowers. Six of cups. You may have children. They may have children. Or, um, this person is very playful. They may be younger than you or you're younger than them. Okay, they want to share. They love to share. They want to give you gifts and shower you with gifts. All right, this person will support you. Okay, some of you may be giving back to charity. You may be happy about that. Okay, or giving back to the homeless. Like just giving like a dollar or two or, you know, whatever you can. It makes you happy. Okay. Yeah, I do see this person wants to give you some flowers, Six of Cups. They have very strong feelings for you. They see you as a soulmate. And this is a very sexual card, you guys, with the Six of Cups. I feel like this is something you've been waiting on for a long time. It may have been three years for some of you because Three of Cups and Three of Wands is here. may have been longer for some of you. It may have not been that long. Alright, but this is something that you're waiting on. This is something that, or this is something that you've been waiting on. Okay, and I feel like you're moving forward. Okay, Cancer Energy with the Chariot. Alright, you're making plans to move, relocate to a different city, state, country, or town. Yeah, this person who you're waiting on, I feel like your ships are coming in for you. And I feel like either you're traveling or this person is coming in towards you. They want a connection with you. Pisces energy. They want to be in a relationship with you. Okay. I feel like for some of you, when this comes in, it may hit you like a ton of bricks. You may be all up in your head about this at first. But I feel like you're going to develop some sort of feelings. Right for this person, you're gonna develop some some love for this person, and I feel like you're gonna be shocked, okay? But I do feel like when this comes in, it may cause you to overthink a little bit. You may have some anxiety over this, but it's this looks really good, you guys, okay. And I feel like after someone has betrayed you, okay, I feel like this is something that you've been waiting on. And it's coming in for you. So, congratulations to you guys on that. Now, I don't know if some of you, this is very specific. Some of you may be um, dealing with someone who may be in jail. Or <clears throat> they may be in, in prison for that is very specific that's not for everybody but for some of you out there someone out there may be dealing with someone who's locked up okay so keep that in mind let's see what comes out for your what's the tea okay someone is having legal issues so i don't know who that is it could be you it could be someone around you it could be your past person it could be this new person pick whatever side you want you guys it could be you Okay, you may be fighting court battles or getting a lawyer. Maybe someone's getting sued or it's just contracts going wrong right now. Okay, it could be you or another Libra, Gemini or an Aquarius. Okay, I feel like someone has no money. It says broke, can't pay bills, scrapping up change to get by. So these legal issues really put a dent in somebody's pocket. Okay, yeah, someone got blocked. So, I take it this is the X for some of you. It says, given no access, no updates, out of the loop. So, you block somebody, you're not interested, okay? Maybe they won't leave you alone. And, you know, maybe they're not getting it through their head that you, you, you're, you're doing something else. You're, you're, someone else is coming towards you who is actually going to love you ten times better than this past person. And you're not budging. You're like, no, I didn't told you. It's over. I'm standing my ground on what I believe in. Look, and this is what's coming in for you. Marriage. You've been waiting so long for this. Making a commitment. It says solid love. I see a long-term relationship coming in for you. Okay. 
This is the best reading I've ever done for y'all in all my time on this platform. This is the most beautifulest reading I have ever, ever done. There's no negative energy here or nothing. This past person is crazy. They're a psycho. They're mentally unstable, some of you. Some of this person has mental issues. Yeah. Yeah, they they they'll throw people under the bus to show off for the opposite sex. They're violent or antisocial. They have that type of behavior. They have no regard for what's for what's right or wrong. Okay. Yeah, this person, this past person is shady. It says giving the impression of dishonesty, questionable, suspicious, and untrustworthy. That's them. And you're moving. You're moving towards a water sign. I'm going to show y'all. So you're moving towards a water sign. Or this, or this water sign is moving towards you. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, like I was telling you before. Okay, you guys. You may be moving into a new home. I do see you moving on, leaving this person behind. Okay, I do see you standing by the water. For some of you, or this is what you're going to be doing. Um, raising your vibration. Letting that ocean just suck up all that negative energy. Or whatever is bothering you. Or whatever is on your mind. Or if you feel stuck, trapped, and blocked, you guys. Or if you're feeling victimized. Or anxiety, fear. Stand by the, stand by the water. Okay? Stand by the ocean. Go to the beach. Stand by the water. And just stand there. Let all of that... Because the ocean is like a, a vacuum cleaner for all the negative energies. And it just it just makes you feel so good when you're finished. So some of you are going to be doing that or you already started doing that. Alright, yeah. So let's see what your um, love oracle has to say. I'm so sorry about the noise from the dog, you guys. But Big Mama wants what Big Mama wants. Okay, so... Let's get into this. What messages do you have for Libra singles for the new person? Can you give me some messages for the new love interests coming towards Libra? The new love interests coming towards Libra? Libra. Libra singles. There's going to be some gossip about this. So you may be telling some people about this person. Or... Some of you, you know what I get? Some of you are very close to your neighbors. Or you're like friends with your neighbors. Maybe you hear some rumors or hear something through the grapevine. Or you're telling someone something or someone is telling you something. Let's see. You may be talking about this new person. Yeah, it says freedom. So you feel a sense of lightness or a sense of um, freedom. Okay, I feel like you and this person right now is very casual, but you feel free. Okay. Some of you are single because, again, you had to cut somebody out of your life, Ice Queen. And I feel like you've been through a lot, Libra. Okay, I feel like you've been through a lot. You may feel some heaviness. I mean, some um, feeling uh, more freedom from your from your mother. Hmm, maybe your mother was controlling. You feel more free. Or you just feel free because of some sort of advice. Or maybe you've used your discernment. And like I said, a lot of you cut this person off. You felt free to be single. It just was like, it's a relief. Okay, Spirit wants you to have more fun. There's fun times ahead with you and this new person. I'm seeing parties, events, concerts. They may invite you out or they just want to have a lot of fun with you. Yeah, you're more self-absorbed. So, you're focused on yourself, your body. You're doing something different to your hair, your clothes, your wardrobe. You're very happy. Okay, you may be the type that's very shy and withholding. Okay, you may be a brunette female or this brunette female is coming towards you. You may be a male or a female. Okay, you may be a fair male or this is the person that's coming in for you. This person may be younger than you because I see children. So if you don't have any children or they don't have any children, I feel like it's just a lot of childlike energy here. Okay, let's see. One more for the new person. 
Okay, work. So you met this person around your workplace or this person is a workaholic or that's you. Or both of you have a profession. You may be in college. Okay, yeah, they want a serious relationship. They want a commitment. I do see marriage coming up for you guys. Let's see. What's the outcome? So marriage, work, a union. I see it coming together. I see a partnership. For some of you, this may start off as a long distance. Okay, so this may be a long distance relationship for some of you. Hmm. And the Three of Wands was showing up, so there may be um, some distance here, guys. There may be long distance in you guys' connection for some of you. Yeah, I told you they want to give you gifts. They want to surprise you. <sighs> These are also talking about your spiritual gifts as well. Mm. You're at the right place at the right time. Things are falling into your lap. Okay, I do see you manifesting. You know, I see you. Um, You may be paying for a new car. Like you're buying a new car or you're getting your car fixed. You may be going to the DMV, signing some sort of document. It could be a license or a permit or something like that. Okay, I feel like this person... This person that's coming towards you may have a car or a truck. Huh. This person wants marriage with you. This is on their mind. I feel like when you meet this person, they're going to have proposals on their mind. Engagement, marriage, harmony, balance. I do see this as a soulmate connection with the Two of Cups. They want unity, love. They want a, a partnership. Okay? And I do see you guys being a happy couple. I see attraction. I see love. I see equality. This is a very good reading. I love this reading. This is excellent. You know, I have not done a reading like this ever. Okay? So, you guys, that is your reading. That's all I have for you guys for today. I hope you enjoyed this reading as much as I did. If you want me to do more readings like this for you, if you want more readings like this from me, okay, um, don't forget, you guys, to like this video up. Hit that like button, please, and thank you, okay? Subscribe to my channel for more. Turn your post notifications on to ALL. Excuse me, so you won't miss any readings that I upload for you guys. I love you guys so, so, so much. Until next time. Bye, Libra. I'll see y'all in the next reading.